pear season arrived, and dozens of 4-Hers are showing off their projects. Uh, Julie Kreisen takes us now to Vetersburg for the Rabbit Show at the Fountain County 4-H Fair. The Fountain County Fair officially started this morning. One of the first events was the Rabbit Show. 4-Hers say it takes a lot of hard work to get bunnies like Zoe ready for the big show. I like cleaner, you know, give her a bath yesterday, and like... Brush her. I brush it and to get the stains off of him I use alcohol or peroxide. And this morning we practiced cleaning them and um, we practiced trying to get them calm. And all Bailey Harper's hard work paid off. She took home the grand champion prize. It was good. I was surprised. More than 50 rabbits of many different breeds were weighed and checked out by the judge. And in order to award the top prize, the judge takes several factors into consideration. All breeds are different. They all have different markings. They all have different body styles. They have different weights. So you have to play everything into, into the importance of showing the rabbits. You've got to go by weight. You've got to look for disqualifications like missing nails, butted teeth, uh, just little things. But it all... Um, it all works into play when you are judging these rabbits. While the kids enjoy showing the rabbits, parents say it also teaches important life lessons. It teaches them respons responsibility. Um, they have to feed and water every day, twice a day, and um, they have fun with it too. While the big show might be over for these guys, the Fountain County Fair's fun continues until Friday night. Reporting from the Fountain County Fair, Julie Kreisen, News Channel 18.